Hello uh, YouTube and what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero and welcome to episode 35 of our relatively new Pokemon Ultra Moon Expanded Let's Play where we're aiming to do the most in-depth Let's Play of this game on YouTube. In the last episode we explored a building that looked like a lot we were in Vermilion City um, and then of course we came here into the library that you see that we're standing at right now. If you didn't check out that episode, make sure you check it out before this episode gets started. In today's episode, our goal is to make it to Mount Hokulani, um, where we'll be preparing to take on the uh, next trial. So if you're excited for this episode, make sure you hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new. If we're going to keep growing, I need your help to do so. Let's go ahead and jump in with a quick team recap. Very quick, very quick. First up, we have Aru Kenimon, our Araquanid, Lindsay, our Lycanroc Dusk, Jet, our Umbreon, Negative Vibes, our Snorlax, Buttons, our Dartrix, and Frisco, the Oracorio. Now, I don't know how much longer this team will stay intact. Um, I do think that it's going to come to a close relatively soon. What's going on over here? <clears throat> Hey mom, do you know how granddaddy's Pokemon are doing? I hope they're okay. I don't know, maybe they're going on an another island challenge with a new trainer. Look at that backpack though. Bartrix jumped out of the Pokeball and trusted to you. You're Granddaddy's Tartrix, aren't you? Wait! Why do you have Granddaddy's Tartrix? Explain how you were entrusted with the Pokeball. You like Granddaddy so much you didn't want to go anywhere, huh? Well, don't worry, Tartrix. From now on, I'll be with you all the time. For the island challenge? I don't know. All I know is I just want to be with it all the time. <laughs> Return Dartrix to its Pokeball. Hand it over to the left Pokeball. Thank you. Dartrix, you have to tell me all about my granddaddy. Like, why did he ever evolve you into it? Why didn't he ever evolve you into it? I can't believe you couldn't I can't believe it couldn't leave the box because it was so attached to my father. It seems like a strong bond can be a burden sometimes. So was that my Dartrix? Oh, my Dartrix is right there. That's strange. Like that's very weird change of events. Apparently grammar eat garbage, but if they run out of garbage to you, sometimes they start taking bites out of nearby buildings. We trainers have to use our formidable skills to keep them in check. Rotom, is Rotom talking about something? I, I honestly just don't care. Alright, we're leading with this, or, uh, Araquanid, right? Yeah. Alright, so our goal is to get everyone to level 30. And then we'll continue on from there. Rotom's talking like every single time I leave a menu, every single time I finish a battle, a wild encounter? Like, that's one thing that in game, or uh, in the anime, Rodom Dex does. He's not always there. I'm curious about my fashion? What are you trying to say? Doesn't that raise his defense or something? Or raise his bow? It's like not very effective or what? I'm gonna go for Bubble Beam. Okay, is this what we're gonna do? Uh. Oh, that makes sense. So when it uses Stockpile, it gains the defense. And then when it uses the other moves, when he uses the other moves, it gets rid of it. It loses that defense. That makes sense. Alright. 
Think of another Trevish. So you're just like a, the trash guy, huh? Also, where in... Oh, I guess it is in Hawaii. Now that I stop and think about it, maybe the grass was this green in Hawaii. I've only been to Hawaii once. Maybe I'll get to go to Hawaii sometime in the next... Or... or... Anyway. I'd be down to go to Hawaii. But I miss Hawaii. Hawaii was fun. I only got to go to Hawaii, like I said, one time. My senior year of college, so, or excuse me, senior year of high school. So it's been eight years now since I've been to Hawaii. Hawaii. Arukenimon hits level 30. I'm really ready for a Decidueye. Gartrix is not my favorite Pokemon. I don't know why, but for some reason... I mean, I get why. I get why that's there. 53 totem stickers. I don't want to cut through here unless I have to. I did have to. 5k. Just sitting on the ground. I can't wait to wear Koma O armor. Okay, hold on. What are all these people doing back here? Huh? Who are you? You need something? Uh, maybe. Oh, hello, Aloha! Did you know that Alolan Grimer are in fact not native to the region at all, but instead are what we could call net, uh, naturalized Pokemon? Hold on. Let me think about Oak's voice. There's not so much sludge and pollution for Grimer to feed on here in Alola, though, so they have grown to feed on garbage instead. They do not give off a foul stench thanks to the way they contain their poisons within their bodies, but their crystals are terribly poisonous. Here, I've got something good for you. Thanks for the friend ball. Did that audio just cut out for you as well? I hope that audio didn't cut out for you as well. I hope you'll try to complete your Pokedex for Rotom's sake as well. I hope you'll never talk about Rotom again. Sea washes away everything, even your muddy feelings and emotions. It's like a good haze will clear blah 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 blah. Thought you were gonna give me haze, that's the only reason I stopped reading. Because at that point I realized I didn't care. Hey, listen, 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 you've gotta hear this. Okay. Hey, thanks. Name's Geister. Now you don't know me, but you know how everybody has their favorite poses for when they throw Pokeballs and whatnot in battle? His moves are called your battle style. And I'm the choreographer who came up with all those battle styles once upon a time. I don't have why I don't have to watch a successor to pass my knowledge on to you, which is why I need you. I want you to battle as my successor. Look, I'm your other, you can't say no. No. Okay, sure. I'm not gonna waste time. Alright, now you've got me as a successor. Let me look at that straight for all you have to do is copy me now. Do what I do. Did he pull a sword on me? He said, Shing! I'll fight you. What do I have around here to fight? I'll fight you with my Weavile. That's all I have. That's literally all I have anywhere near me to fight. So, he gives different battle styles, but what's the point? Alright, I say we're about done, yeah? Let's go today and get on home. Rhymer! Hey, what are you doing out here, kid? This is a restricted area. We're working here. Seriously, boy, aren't you a Mali native? We're famous for our hospitality. <laughs> okay, and kids need to explore and see the world. How else are they going to learn? I swear. I yes, fa- I, I mean, sir. Yes, sir. If that's what you really want, then I will tell this random trespasser about what it is we do here. This is what we take care of. This is where we uh, this is where we take care of all the garbage produced in the Alola region, young man. The janitors work together with our Pokémon towards this goal. In fact, the garbage that human workers gather is consumed by muck and grimer, like this one here. The president here beside me has a muck that can eat ten tons of rubbish in a single day. So me and grimer here are still just temporary contract workers. 
But isn't that an, uh, but isn't that an island challenge amulet you have there? I took on the trials myself when I was a kid, though so it was a bit too much for me, and so I ended up giving up right away. Look here, kid. It seems to me that my mucks had a bit too much to eat today. How about you join me in a battle and prove it with a bit of exercise to aid the old digestion? I'd be happy to. Who am I leading with? Snorlax. Good, you got the kutzpa. Chut the chutzpa? What does that mean? I have never heard that word in my life. And let's get this thing happening. I'm leading Snorlax and you're gonna send out an Alolan muck? Would not recommend, Janner Sean. Also, the other guy is like, I thought he was like, just like an ace trainer or something. I certainly didn't think he was that much older than What is this background? This background is not what I was expecting. Why would you minimize? Why would you minimize? That's right! You minimize and are uh, okay. If you're gonna minimize, then I'm just gonna dodge and I'm not gonna feel bad about it. Okay, that did nothing. Let's just go for body slam. Oh, because if he uses Minimize, then doesn't my Body Slam do, like, twice as much or something? Yep. I just learned that not too long ago. If your opponent uses Minimize, then Body Slam is guaranteed to hit and does, like, 1.5 times the damage or 2 times the damage or something like that. I don't know. IDK. IDK. Eh, not too shabby. Just like I figured you've got something in you, kid. Amazing, you even beat my fu- I mean, my boss's muck. What are you doing standing there like a lump? You're up next, you useless. You see, this is just like you did with your trials when you were a kid. The moment something starts to look tough, you give, you give up, uh, you give a cry and off you run. You give up, and you're supposed to be my son. How can I leave this plant to you if you never learn the value of a bit of hard work? I can't ever leave things in your hand if you don't give me a reason to trust you can handle it. Dang. Said straight up. Straight up. He said, I will not run away anymore. I will give this everything that I've got. Oh, I mean, I'll smack you up. I am a man now. Just you watch, father. I mean, sir. That guy sounds like... I mean, okay. He looks 16 or 17. He doesn't look no... Oh, uh, wait. That... It, his animation, he looks like 22, 23. I don't know. He ain't no, he ain't no adult yet. He ain't no adult yet. You ain't been through nothing yet, my guy. Let me just tell you. Let me just, let me just tell you. If you're uh, about that age, if you're about that age. Ain't been through nothing yet. Might think you're an adult. And you might technically be an adult. But let me tell you. Now, obviously, there are some exceptions, and that's not always the case. But man, I did not realize at 22, 23, I was not an adult yet. Anyway, another story. Blast it all! You... I'm sorry, Father. I really am. Just a weakling. You're hired! Oh, I've gotta stop yawning. What the heck? I'm not your father. I'm your boss. And I'm saying that you're hired, boy. From this day forth, I make you the head of the plant. And I won't hear another word of complaint about it from you. What? You saw that this trainer was stronger than you or even me. And you still and your Grimer went up against him with everything that you had in you. That's what I've always wanted to see from you. That kind of persistence and drive. That's why you and Grimer, that's why you're going to take over for me. You know, I would say... I would agree. Except that you specifically used Minimize. And I smacked you up because of it. So... Why did he press Minimize? When he knew I was just going to smack him up for it. So that's it. So that's it. All right, cool. On to route ten, we go.
I was looking to see if there was anything special, but there does not appear to be. We're going to head right this way. Now, I have over the last several episodes, I've been talking about a new Pokemon joining the team on this island. But I don't think it's going to happen before this next trial. I think we're going to have one more trial with the current team. And then I think there will be at least one change. If I remember correctly. Also, if I remember correctly, I don't believe we can head down this way. Let me look. Let me look at the map. Yeah, we still have... Yeah, we're still not quite in the area. We're just gonna go up. We're gonna go over to Route 10, which is where we're supposed to go. I don't know if you'd describe the bird Pokemon in Lola as being comfortable around people. Um, or just plain aggressive. Alright, what do we got? Who are you? Oh, looks like you're a trial goer, eh? I've got a favor to ask you then. I'd be happy to help. Route 10 is a long wide, blah 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 blah. My stuff will hadn't been getting much exercise lately. So I let them out of their balls to have them run around a bit, but they haven't come back. I want to go look for them, but it's hard for an old lady like me to trapeze all around. If you find one of my little stuff, will you just tell them to come back to me? They're impish creatures, but smart as a cookie, and with noses that could sniff out anything. They'll find their way back home to me. Will you help me find my stuff around Route 10? Sure. Eight stuff will lost out there around some baby bear hiding. I just realized that I skipped over a quest. Now, this is random. This is extremely random. But we're going to fly back to uh, the, uh, the Hano Resort and do a quick thing. Because I forgot to do this before. Listening Sweat, Slippery Goo, the perfect tune that keeps Hano Beach going. Pukumuku chuckers are desperately needed. Why won't you become a Pukumuku ch trucker? I'm one of the staff members responsible for keeping Hano Beach spotless for our guests. A Pukumuku sometimes wriggles up on our, on our beach from the sea. I don't know why they do it, but we can't just leave them there. They shrivel up on land, and that's not all. Our guests get grossed out seeing them, and sometimes even get hurt stepping on them. We end up with no choice but to chuck these poor Pukumuku back into the sea. I'll explain the job to you. I know what to do. Thank you. Wait. Oh my goodness. Okay, great. Six Pukumuku left. This one's shiny? Oh no, it's just in the green. Pukumuku. Alright. Number two, Pukumuku. Oh, you can play with yourself. Three. Four. This one's a long shot. I had to chunk that. I had to chuck that one way back. Five. And I'm pretty sure the last one's just going to be right down here. Nothing special, but I also think that it's going to be like $20,000 or something like that. It's like all the Pukumuku are gone from the beach. Good job, part-timer. You know what? You don't have to make fun of me for being a part-timer, dang it. Got every last Pukumuku that was stranded on the beach back into the sea. Now they're safe where they should be, and the beach is safe for our guests. You're a real good worker, you know. You have a real knack for Pukumuku chucking. And you've got your and I've got your pay ready for you right there. Take it, you've earned it. 20k. Feel free to come back tomorrow to also do it. Now I don't think that's gonna be my primary way of making money. I still gotta figure out how I'm gonna make the money for the Komo'o armor. I think I'm just gonna need to cycle the 
Pokemon League. I wonder if I should use Wi-Fi team. That's a whole nother story. Uh, I don't even know if I want to do Wi-Fi. That's a... Oh, oh, I'm about to get swooped. I'm about to get swooped on. I should switch. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Just in case I get swooped on on this route. Wait, what's this guy want? I was walking by that tree and a Pokemon landed right on my head. I don't know if I should call it luck or what. This guy scurred. Got scared. Got scared. Whoa, look at this guy. Firefighter Alex. Firefighter Alex. Sent out Octi- You would send out an Octillery because you saw me- You saw me over on, on, on the other side of that tree, didn't you? You totally saw me on the other side of that tree. Don't die. Don't die to Octazooka. Bubble Beam? That's even worse. Oh, take it! Woo! It's okay, Lindsay. You're fine. Don't panic, Lindsay. Smack him up! Woo! Ooh, almost level 30 off of that. I said I lost. I was extinguished. One battle. That freaking bubble beam. Oh, because he's a firefighter. One stuff. I see stuff number two. I also see a super potion. Do I see stuff number three back here? That's saying stuff, stuff. Okay. There's a, this is like only the second tree that has had packages. Only the second tree that's had a Crabrawler. Also, are we going to run into another legendary at some point? Can we do that? I think I have to defeat this thing before it'll let me on through. We got Bubble Beam as well. A little while. Ugh, so close. So close! Negative vibes, but... Oh, no, 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 no. Don't make me switch into Oracorio. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, no, 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 no! Switching into Lucari. Oh, Lucario. Oracori. Oh, oh, oh! Yeah. Yeah. A Qualot Berry. A Kelpsy Berry. And a Pomeg Berry. I don't know what a lot of these berries do off the top of my head. Young boy with an Island Challenge amulet, your Pokemon are looking a bit tired. Okay. Oh, train. There you are. How did you not see me? I was like six feet in front of you. I was literally running past you so that you would, like, see me and battle me. But I think what we'll do is we'll finish up this episode by finishing up this quest and this route. And then the next episode, we're going to head to the top. We might go ahead and do the next trial. Which might wind up being a good send-off for... Uh, which might wind up being a good send-off for, uh, starts with an, uh, an R, no, it starts with an L, Lycanroc. Lycanroc. So, you hit me with Electro Ball. I got staticed off of you, so you used Confuser. So what was your thought process? Was your thought process, oh, I got the static, now let's go for Confuse Ray so I can Parafusion him? Or was your thought process like, I don't want him to have any fun playing the game, so I'm just going to destroy him. I, I don't know. It's stuck. 
No, Siri, I don't see anything for you. Be quiet. A Firo. Oh, uh, it's not gonna let me run, is it? I need rock to. Alright. You know, I've never understood. A lot of people complain about a lot of the mechanics in Pokemon. This is the one for me. This is the one that makes me the most mad. Like, not being able to escape from wild Pokemon. Like, I get it to an extent, but it's like... I don't know. I don't know. I don't... I don't really like that. Personally. Personally. Found a Max Revive. Surely there can't be mo- like, Buses can get a whole lot of people to where they need to go all at once. But I'd kind of like to see a whole herd of ride Pokemon like Tauros stampeding together. <clears throat> <clears throat> so what this officer wants to fight what's new what's freaking new officer wants to fight where have i heard that before where have i heard that before that's funny officers want to fight and then i run into a gum sheet coincidence coincidence Not a coincidence. Okay, I will head back as soon as I... Why'd you turn around like that? Why are you so scared of me? My impression of Sire is pretty good, eh? I'm pretty good at Pokemon battles, too. Why would you be so scared turning around like that? Officer... Police Officer Mitchell. You don't say. Your name is Mitchell. You have a Growlithe. Can't get upset. I can't get upset. You have a Growlithe. Did you just flame burst? What level is this? Level 30 and you're using flame burst? Hold that paralysis, my guy. Hold that paralysis, my guy. I really want that Komoo armor, man. What's gonna be the best way for me to make money? Should I level up my Festival Plaza? Wait a second. Should I level up Festival Plaza? We have one Pokemon left to get to level 30. I think that, I think that's the end of the route. Oh, shoot. Who was that? Is that a dust ox? A pineco? So we just being Brock out here, huh? So we just being Brock out here, huh? I have not caught a Pokemon on screen in a long time. Not starting today. Not starting today. I haven't seen these guys in a minute. What? You never see someone take a bus stop to go before? Hey, yo, you trying to steal our bus stop? Let's go find your own, you heard? He said, uh, yeah, good. So, wait, 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 wait. They're fighting me because we're at the same bus stop? Just... Be the drowsy guy. The hound dude. Hound. Dower is what I meant to say. Now, I have to apologize because you didn't know what you were getting into. Glycanroc, tear him to shreds. I want him ended. Bury him under the earth. Continental crush. Let's go! End him! 
End him. End him. You're done. You're done. You're done. Done. Everybody's level 30. Perfect. Perfection. Perfect. You can't you can't beat that. You can't beat that. Dang, I lost and my homies gotta fight you. That's just life in Team Skull. We stand up to even the strong, yo. We stand up, but not for long, yo. Hey. Am I gonna hit it again? Am I gonna hit it again? Like and rock, what you think? What you think, big dog? What you think, big dog? Gonna hit it again on him? Oh, we gonna hit it again on him. Oh, we gonna hit it again on him. You know what? You know what? Oh. Not today. Not today. I can't turn. I can't turn. Yeah, I can turn. I don't know. That looks weird. I can't even see myself. I don't know how weird it looks when I do that. Olivia would, like, go above and beyond for these freaking... For the Z-move. You're gone. You're gone. Get out of here. Now, that's not the last time that we see that move. I don't care. <laughs> I don't know if you care, but that bus stop weighs about as much as a golem. As a golem. Interesting. Interesting. Yo, think about the bus drivers. If we take this bus stop, they can all chill. Oh, I'm over this. Back to living at large at the mansion. Huh. At the mansion? You got a long way to go. Domino! What's going on? Some Team Skull Punks just ran past me in the other direction, yeah? I sure wish they'd challenge the League instead of getting up to no good all the time. League? Oh ho, you'll find out soon enough. Just you wait, cousin. But first things first, if you want to head up to Mount Hokulani, we should take the bus. It'll blast us up to the top. Yeah, as quick as the sky uppercut. Woo! Before we do that, we are going to run back. Run back. Oh, wait, we got two things I got to do with that case. Let's actually run back. Pineco, did you not see how long this episode was already? I'm trying to end the episode, Pineco. You're trying to explode. I ain't stupid. I ain't stupid. I know what you're trying to do. And I'm not here to have it. I'm not taking this from you. I'm not taking this from you, Pineco. I'm not taking this from you, Pineco. Oh, you child. All my stuff was made it back thanks to you. You've been a great help to me. I surely do owe you, my young friend. Have this muscle band for me as a token of my appreciation. Sure. And 15k. Now you're talking my language. If that's another pine co okay, it's a fear. What if it was like a... Dragonite? Dragon Knight just like swooped. I was like, I'm here now. That'd be wild. That's all I got. All right, I'm hugging the south end of this. Oh, wait. My Pokemon look a bit tired, apparently. How can I not fit through there? Alright, and we're gonna hop off, turn around, and we're gonna go ahead and end the episode right there. Episodes are getting more productive. Today started out at that poison power plant thingy, my bobber, and then we did all of this Route 10 stuff. If you wound up enjoying today's episode, make sure you hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new. If we're gonna be the next big thing, then we need you to share out these videos so that more people can see what we're doing here. We do have a name for our, our people coming soon we'll probably wait till this series is over again if you enjoyed hit the like button subscribe if you're new and we'll see you for the next episode where we're heading to the top of mount hokulani to go from there until then have a blessed day